Bye bye bye. Ba 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 ba. Couple of changes coming to the channel. Um, most notably, our editor and producer, Madison, is uh, flying the coop. <laughs> she is um, going to be too busy hunting ghosts. We'll link, uh, we'll link in the description. Uh, and we wish her a fond farewell and um, hope uh, she has a great time and Hopefully is still able to sleep at night because I don't know if I could do that. <laughs> so um, wish her well in the comments, please. Thank you, Madison, for all of your hard work. Hey, Ben, mm. did you hear? We got a Patreon. No way. Way. Thank you, Emily. You are our first, our very first patron, and we love you dearly. And uh, thank you, and please enjoy your extra content, mm -hmm. including photos and behind the scenes stuff, occasional outtakes. <laughs> enjoy our Discord server. When we do release merch, you'll get early access to that. Ooh, fancy. And uh, thanks for supporting us. We appreciate it. So, my big goodbye to Madison, our editor, um, is uh, gonna be, uh, you don't have to do the work to remove all the swears and shit from this video. It's all on Ben now. <laughs> Some are hard. That one's just not wanting to come out, huh? Nope. I'm like getting these, getting these to come out. There might be a knot in there. Who knows? I just can't even get them to break off at the bottom. Yeah, some of these pieces are pretty knotty. Yeah. Knotty wood. <laughs> oh yeah, there's a knot. Is it the king of Nottingham? Not in this life. <laughs> what a pain in the butt. This is not what I was looking forward to today. <laughs> yeah, you, you do not look impressed. It's not that big of a problem, but it's... Not not that big of a problem? Correct. You're not wrong. <laughs> God, we're such... Works. Hmm. Oh yeah, there's a very big knot in there, huh? Mm hmm. It's not helpful. Not ideal. <laughs> not, not helpful. Really the knot. I know. I've said it like twice, not meaning to. Oh yeah, look at that. Did you see that? Can I take that? Yeah. Yeah. So when you're trying to do won't really anything, any of the cutting and stuff, anywhere where there's a knot or um, the grain is not as you would expect it to be, it really makes for a real pain to get out. We haven't learned how to see these things ahead of time. Yet, so. No, and that's that's partially, you know, um, when you're when you're selecting wood for your beams, if you have a good long time. Um, you're you're selecting anytime. anytime if you're doing it yourself and you know which beam is going to be for what part of your house whether it's going to have a lot of cutouts or no cutouts it's really easy to say okay no that one's not going to be so good like some of these here i mean look at all of the knots in there and you know that one has a lot of small knots which shouldn't be a huge issue but it could also mean that when we're we're doing cutouts, you know, it just suddenly has oh psh. something's been over here eating. 
There's dried grapes and grape seeds in here. In this hole. <laughs> one of the one of the squirrels or chipmunks was like, Yeah, that's that that's a good that's a good place. That's a good place for my food. Probably sitting in there in the rain. Probably. This is a nice respite. <laughs> Nothing like a sombrero though. Oh my god. So, um here, this is this is a good explanation. So there's a lot of knots here. This was a knot. And when we were drilling down into here to make the pocket, this whole section started popping forward. So when you watch the video where we raised this beam, um, you'll see that there was a piece of pallet, uh, just some pallet wood, two by four pallet wood, um, here, screwed in here. And we did that to put counter pressure in on all of this here so that it wouldn't pop out when we were getting this post set. And that stuff that we're, we're slowly figuring out that we need to do, um, here you can see all of these knots here um, bowed out and that chunk of wood just popped right out when it was being cut. Um, so, you know. We might have to reinforce there, but. Yeah, but you know, having to having to work with what the wood is giving you, that's that's one of the things about all of this. Um it's one of the pros and the cons of this style of building is you know, we're we're working with the the natural product that hasn't been it hasn't been sanitized. <laughs> right. it, it, it is as it is. It hasn't, it. yeah, it hasn't been, um, you know, hand selected, you know, where you only get like one tiny beam per tree because it's the only one that isn't, you know, crazy knotted. Well, and a lot of commercial timbers aren't really as good as you think they are either. They're just, they just look better on the surface. Well, because they've been kiln dried and then they've been recut again. Right. But, you know, how, when was the last time you, you know, used a two-by-four in a project and trying to put nails through and you just keep hitting knot after knot? Mm -hmm. I mean, that's not helpful either. No, it's not. You can't, you can't see it. I know I keep saying it. <laughs> We're going to have to have a knot counter. Um, I will not do it. I will not. I refuse to knot. Not going to do it. <laughs> so, you know, we're just, we're working with what we have. We're trying to do our best. Um... Trying to make sure that we look at what we're doing. That one you couldn't you couldn't see that there was going to be a knot there from the outside. It just wasn't visible, and it even had it even looks like it's almost uh, it's almost like fat wood. I in probably there. if that. I looked around to this side, I would have seen it, but um, I didn't think in advance on it. So yeah, I mean it's an okay spot for it to be. Yeah, it's, it's not going to cause. Yeah, it's not going to cause any any. Um, you sure it's not? Mm. <laughs> it's, it it won't <laughs> cause any um, permanent issues. It's I'm just, just... Glad there's no won'ts in this beam. Oh my god! I'm sorry. It's not funny anymore. It's just not. No, nope. nope. it's just not. It's just not.
We're just using some of these extra pieces um, to shim it a little bit because, uh, well, we're working with natural materials and it's not always perfect. And we're trying to go, you know, fairly quickly. So again, it's not going to be perfect. But uh, that looks, that looks pretty friggin' amazing. <laughs> Gotta say. So uh, we're probably gonna be heading out because I am. Um, I can't see, so I'm. We also have a storm warning. Yeah, we have a storm warning coming in so that's no good and uh, I can't see very well so that's also no good um, walking around while the world is kaleidoscoping while having a baby on your back is really sketchy I don't like it oh, sounds like fun to me. <laughs> so uh, we're gonna we're gonna head out for today and uh, when we come back out not tomorrow because it's supposed to be raining again all day yep. um, but I don't know. Are we going to come out Monday for your birthday? I don't know. It's supposed to be raining all day. Tomorrow's supposed to be nice. Is it tomorrow that's supposed to be nice? Mm -hmm. I don't know anything. I know it is. It's fine. Um, but uh, the next time we come out, uh, maybe we'll be doing this one. We're going to have to clean out all of the um, mouse goo. Well, it's grape goo. Yeah, that was uh, that was way more terrifying than it actually is. It's... Mean the mouse it's... Crust, <laughs> yeah. <Yes. No. laughs> The, the grape goo. The both skin and mouth go squish. Oh, that would be awful. <laughs> I, ha I would feel horrendous. I already feel really bad when we roll one of these beams and I see a spider has been squished. I feel awful. <laughs> it happens. All right. It really does. No, oh, yeah. It's obviously something's going on because the Keats all just went upstairs. Yep. I need They're plastic. like done. I need plastic. I need all right. Plastic now. Ah, oh, you get the stub laid out. Nice, nice. Uh, I'm gonna lay out the stub, I think, before I lay anything else. I'm gonna do one step at a time. Just because, well, all sides are the same. Yeah. Weather, all these things. So I'm gonna get ready to cut this. And which vertical is this, Ben? This is the last corner vertical on the north face. Nice. Uh, it'll be our third going up which means that we'll be able there there's there's all three in the same shot <laughs> which means we'll be able to uh throw up our girts after this that's gonna be that's gonna be pretty cool oh, yeah. oh and the baby is starting to fuss well i never expected that to happen. oh she has been so trying lately trying to fuss we're just trying <laughs> trying like the trials work. and tribulations of a toddler trying time Try, yeah 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 she's trying like to... our coffee blend dark times oh my god <laughs> nice product placement shameless plug during these difficult trying times, times. <laughs> i gotta go get her settled you cut <laughs> Just trying to stay warm until I'm needed. We only have one set of tools, so we can't do it together at the same time. So, since I'm wearing a baby, I, uh, I will stay by the fire until I'm needed. As of today, there are 127 of you subscribers, and we love each and every one of you. You subscribers, you. <laughs> you are all awesome for subscribing and uh, following us on this journey, and we really appreciate it. Yeah, things that changed this week. Uh, uh, we are now editing, well, it changed last week anyway. Uh, we are now editing our own YouTube channel, um, the closing of the cafe um was horrendously tragic and we are still not okay with it um it does leave us a little extra time so uh, time for our former editor yes their thing yes go be ghost hunters go see all the spookies um 
And uh, we're doing that wall. Um... Ow. Yeah, well, you're standing kind of close. <laughs> it didn't actually hurt, but it came flying right at me and hit me right in the belly button. <laughs> um, we are uh, still roasting coffee and shipping to all 50 states. Um, we are trying to build this house. We we have put up two. What are you looking for? Oh, sitting back. No. Oh, this is our cool new bucket bag, which is cool. Well, we don't need, we don't need to do product placement. We're not product placement. No, just saying. The it's editor cool. will edit that out. That's fine. I know them. You need me to go get a different one? Apparently. Okay. So we are now editing our own videos. We are still roasting coffee. We are building a house. Uh, and we are homeschooling the kids. It's, it's, it's been a lot, Easy. <laughs> but we're, we're happy to be here with you. And, uh, we, we appreciate every subscribe we get. My phone dings and I do a little subscriber What's dance. So long? We're waiting on wood to be split. Just grab a piece. <laughs> the big kids Please? might be dragging their feet cause it's chilly. Then bring it to me. Did I hear you say you're doing girts? We're doing girts. Do you mean to go right here? Three verticals are up. I want to get this wall mostly complete before we start going to the other corners. Whee! <laughs> I'm ready. The baby might fuss, but I'm ready. Oh! <laughs> there will be another one on this side, so that's why there is a gap. Oh! <laughs> nice. Well, the sun is setting because it's 3.30, which makes total sense. Uh, Walgurts. <laughs> that's, uh, that's what we did this week. Uh, we got three of our verticals. <laughs> got three of our verticals up and... The Walgurts for this side are done. I'm uh, kind of shocked. It felt like so long to get here. It took forever for the foundation to be ready. And then Ben's knee. And now it's like every time we come out here, we're finishing a significant, like not insignificant. Like that's, that's a big deal. Just... I'm just psyched. <laughs> Are you psyched with me? Let me know in the comments below. If, you en if you're enjoying this trip, this journey you're taking with us, give us a subscribe. Click that bell and you'll get notified every time we do an upload, which we try to do at least once a week. We appreciate it. We also appreciate our Patreons. We currently have one. Thank you, Emily. <laughs> And uh, if you'd like to join Emily and uh, help us out on this journey, help us with the with the random things that we buy to help our lives here, like a spoke shave or you know a new drill bit, even five dollars, it goes it goes a long way because it's money that we don't currently have, and we appreciate every dime. Yeah, check out the description. Click our links. We appreciate it. Sorry. Do you love me? I do.
I'm having an ocular migraine, so this whole section of my vision is kaleidoscoping, and I feel like I'm moving. Oh, there's a new kaleidoscope going up the center. I'm going to go um, trip balls for a few minutes. I'll be back. School time. The phone is ringing, which is also the theme song oh, okay. one of my favorite podcasts, Dark Future Dice. <laughs> I thought it was an alarm. <laughs> it's your phone ringing. Yeah. Dark Future Dice. Nice podcast. Check them out wherever you listen to podcasts. That is not a paid endorsement. Though if they would like to pay us, we would be fine with that. <laughs> <laughs> they, they're paid with Patreon, so like, that would feel awkward. That would feel awkward, that's right. What do you call a subscriber of a YouTube channel? What do you mean? A you subscriber. I just looked at the phone as if it was going to tell me whether that was funny or not. <laughs> It said I, nothing. I heard the laughter. It said nothing. <laughs> I let the can out of that laughter. I let the laughter out of that can. Oh, that worked out. Yes. Hey, I can do that. I'm the editor now. <laughs> <laughs>